What's up and welcome to another episode of It's Tip Top Fishing. My name is Keaton Ditchfield and today we are fly fishing for yellowfish in the Vaal. You can probably hear it in the background. I'm super excited because there is where we're fishing. We're here with Hansi who is a guide here. If you guys want to get his details to come fly fishing, we'll take you through everything. We've got some novice family members here from the States. Two of them have two of them never fished or well, have fished fly fishing before but like once or twice and then we've got Kurt who's fished many times and then over there where there is Hansi who's going to take us through he gives you all the gear and all that kind of thing so I'm excited let's get fishing we've got the star star players here there you go there's Kurt Devin Sheena Hansi well, fishermen. Hopefully, each one of them are going to catch a yellow fish or two. Hey? <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. So, we're in the river. We've got Sheena, Dave, Kurt, and Hans. And it's time to go fishing. I've already caught this tree and had to retie all of my flies. So, my plan is. I'm going to try and get these guys into a fish, help hunts get these guys into a fish and then I will try to catch a fish myself and then I'll let you know what we did to catch those fish. I decided to take the OSA 18 litre dry pack with me to give it a proper test and it passed with flying colours. It was wet the entire day and on the inside I had camera equipment, clothes, food and everything I needed for the day trip and everything was bone dry by the end of the day. It worked perfectly. And I'm targeting, you can see there's a rock there and there's some slack water. You slack, you target the join between them. Usually the yellow fish and carp are sitting just behind that rock waiting for things to come past because they don't want to constantly fight the, the stream or the current. Yeah, let's keep going, keep trying. We've been fishing for a while now. She is hooked onto one but she didn't land it. Seems to be quite a tough day because the water is quite murky. Update, we've been fishing for a while. The conditions are treacherous, as Tom would say, the fish right in front of me. The conditions are bad. Why? Because the flow is heavy, so the fish are spread out, there's more area for them to go to. And then the other thing is the water's very murky. So I'm going to get some spinning tackle because Americans want some spinning tackle to try it. And so that's what I'm going to do. Spinning tackle in tow and in the backpack. Let's go. Hopefully Sheena's going to catch something on these little uh, little uh, jerk baits and stuff. Let's hope. I just want them to catch a yellow fish. You know, get the Americans into some yellow fish get that ticked off their bucket list. I guess it's the same thing as South Africans wanting to catch uh, redfish or snook or American snook or their sheep's head. No. So, change of plan. Um, we were fishing and then it was like a, it was a hard day's fishing but the weather has turned on us. Big storm coming and you don't really want to be in the water when a storm hits because the water from upstream 
turns knee deep water into neck deep water. And you just don't want to mess around with that. It's not fun, it's not safe, it's not clever, it's not good to risk stuff like that. With that said, we decided to end the session there. Unfortunately, we didn't catch anything, as in land anything. Sheena did hook one, Hansi did hook one, but unfortunately, we didn't land anything. The conditions were absolutely wrong for uh, yellow fishing, unfortunately. No one else on the bank caught anything, no one else in the river caught anything, and the only two fish that we heard of that were hooked were the ones that we hooked up on. It was a wonderful session, it was a tough session, but we all had a good time. If you guys would like to support It's Tip Top Fishing, make sure to click subscribe or consider being a Tip Top Patron. Every cent made from Patreon will be dedicated to make bigger and better videos for you guys. Thank you so much for watching, that's it for this episode. Till next time, tight lines guys.